Hey, this is Bill Wynn, and um, like a number of people, I've had a couple issues here. Uh, number one, the um, recent transactions not refreshing uh, either here on the overview page or here as well. And uh, so I did uh, write to ProCommerce, and uh, they did give me some instructions as to what could be happening. Uh, another thing is uh, through the upgrades here, 1.3.4.1, 1.3.5, um, I had a couple pages where there were all of these uh, generated but not accepted. And so I have seen uh, other people uh, with this as well, uh, some different ideas of what's happening out there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow the instructions and record it here. Uh, for you in case you want to go through this uh, setup yourself. So first, uh, they, they uh, suggest we go over to the d debug window. Once you're in there, you go to the console. Uh, once you are here, you will type in clear wallet transactions. And uh, there's no spaces, just uh, one long uh, word of three words clear wallet transactions. I'm going to hit enter. Uh, once we see that it has completed, we see if it's actually removed uh, 8,741 transactions. Okay, um, And then it actually gives some ideas. You could reload with uh, reload token data or you could re-index or re-download the blockchain and that would be going and deleting the blockchain. So uh, we see here now we're actually looking at zero proc. Uh, we see the transaction history is there. So I'm going to close the wallet. That's the next step. And I'm going to go ahead and open the wallet back up. Okay, so uh, here we have just all of the transactions have been totally cleared out. Okay. So then the next step they uh, suggest is going to the debug and going to the console and typing in this scan for all TXNS, which is scan for all transactions, and then do. 310,000 and hit enter. So what is now happening is it is scanning um, for all of the valid and non-valid blocks and it will also repopulate all of those transactions. So this should uh, fix transactions that are not showing in the log per uh, the wallet tests. Okay, so what we're going to do here is uh, let this sit and I'll be back. Okay, so uh, here we are. It continued the uh, complete uh, scan. You see it says scan complete. Uh, interesting enough, uh, it appears as though um, I've lost uh, about 1.7 million um, coins. However, uh, I do have a backup, so I'm not concerned about that. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to restart the wallet just to uh, bring it back up. And that is what I'm showing, 7.7. .7. And um, everything is in sync. So I am going to communicate with them uh, about this and verify that that is accurate. Okay, so I got a reply back and uh, the reply was that uh, I had actually sent them an email saying, you know, my balance dropped from 9.4 to 7.7 .7, and it is possible, of course, that some invalid blocks can get uh, accounted for and, and hit the balance. Um, you know, when you're working with computers, you always see these little inconsistencies. Um, so anyway, they did say that it was expected that possibly some invalid blocks could have been added to the balance. 
um, and so then they suggest try scanning from block one. So if you remember what I did was I uh, scanned for all transactions from uh, 3,001, uh, uh, sorry, 310,000. So I'm going to do a scan for all T uh, XNS and I'm going to do one. Okay. Okay, so I just completed that scan from block one, and you can see the 9.4 back, so fantastic. Now I'm going to just go ahead and reset my wallet. It seems like good protocol to reset the wallet, uh, I mean restart it, after any time that you um, work in the console and modify the wallet.dat file uh, so that you reinitiate the database um, from start. So fantastic. Um, so if I look, uh, we'll see if it's actually updating real time. Um, but if we go in here and we go back uh, pages and pages and pages, it, it uh, no longer has those missed blocks. So that's uh, fantastic. I think we had on page six before, so let me just jump over there. And we just see all green check marks, so that's awesome. And I uh, hope that helps.